In God's name, the most gracious, the mercy giver, I want to explain to you that a series of glands in the vagina or vulva that sometimes grow are the same Bartholin glands that produce secretions and mucus to make the vagina more slippery. They usually exist naturally, but sometimes they become so inflamed that if we mechanically close the duct, it can be an obstacle to insemination or childbirth. Usually this should be operated on or drained for some reason. Now, due to trauma, the duct becomes inflamed and closes and sometimes Bartholin glands become large and sometimes they even turn into tumors or cancer of the Bartholin gland. If we close this duct mechanically, the duct either in regard to execution or an exit route for delivery will be in trouble. Typically, it should be surgically removed or drained. The first stage I see now is that we have completely closed the enlarged duct. If the urinary duct is so large that it can cause a problem with urination, it also narrows the urethra making it difficult to urinate. It absolutely, absolutely should be drained. If it's drained, well that's fine, it's not a problem. But considering that I was last week, I completely drained it, but it has grown back. It could likely become a tumor of the Bartholin gland. It's better if we surgically remove it so it doesn't cause issues during labor, nor should it have problems with urination. It wouldn't really have a significant effect, and if it is removed, it won't cause any specific problem for the livestock. Thus, it's better to perform surgery and remove this lump. I hope this was a good case for our dear friends. Make sure to coordinate more closely with the vet. In such situations, if it is drained while it's small, it's much better than letting it reach this condition. If it does get to this state and becomes a tumor, the Bartholin gland should be removed as quickly as possible to avoid further complications for the livestock.